ENCA called me and uh, they said to me, listen, we obviously we are witnessing un social unrest across the country and we would like you to do a documentary on what's currently happening. And that was the brief. Just put together a documentary, use your skills, use your equipment, use everything that you have at your disposal. And uh, so I started mapping it out and I been interviewing different people. Um, I've been interviewing looters, I've been interviewing um, you know, um, experts in economics, um, political analysts, uh, people from all walks of life really, people who've been touched by the unrest. And as I was driving, filming things like um, traffic lights that have been destroyed, and so, uh, shopping malls, I came across a group of young people dressed in bright yellow shirts and, and jackets, etc. And they were cleaning one of the supermarkets, um, you know, and they had been joined by a group of uh, people from the community. And I thought, this, this is very exciting, this is interesting, it's going to work brilliantly for, for the documentary that I'm putting together. And I thought, let me speak to them, let me see what, what, what they are doing and why they are doing it. And the more I spoke to these guys, um, the more I realized that, wow, they are really driven by a sense of purpose. They are doing this not because they, are, they feel compelled, but, they, but because it, you know, it's something that comes from the bottom of their hearts. You can tell that they are driven by a sense of patriotism. They are driven by, by wanting to see their country um, you know, being, being a better place to live in. I, I looked at some of them, young guys, and I thought, I mean, these are people who should be out there just, you know, living their lives, but they've decided to get involved in something this important. I, I thought that was, that was really impressive. And I also felt that, you know, South Africa needs to see this kind of thing. You, the young and old getting involved in, in rebuilding their country. I think, the, you know, these guys set, set a very good example of, of where South Africa can go when people work together. There's so much good out there. Uh, there are people who truly want to see wonderful things. Uh, there's, there's an abundance of, of goodness out there. I think this is going to work out beautifully for the documentary that I'm putting together because it will show the, the beautiful side of South Africa. Ubuntu, we call it Ubuntu. I am because you are. You know, what, what, what volunteer ministers are doing uh, in restoring order, in, in assisting in terms of the cleanup campaign, truly speaks to that. And so the story that I'm doing, uh, especially the latter parts of the story, uh, shows South Africans coming together. Not only did I do, do the story as a journalist, but I also, kind of, you know, in a, in a very selfish way, I, I felt inspired. So it was also for me personally, really, you know, the more I spoke to the guys, I, I felt that I was getting inspired. So as much as I'm doing a documentary, I'm also learning and I'm getting inspired.